Hey everybody, Mark here from American Aeration, and in this short video, I want to go over a remote manifold component of a subsurface diffused aeration system. Now, I've talked about remote manifolds before, uh, a little bit about how to use remote power. This is power that is not right by the pond edge. It could be 100 feet away or 300 feet away or farther. Usually anything within a thousand feet, we might think about using remote power if it's accessible enough and if we can work with the ground between the power source and the pond edge and that's fairly clean and unobstructed, we might go with something like a burial airline to deliver the air to the pond edge. And if you have multiple diffusers involved in the setup, this is how you would work with this. The pump, of course, would go by the power source and then you would bury something typically 5 8 inch poly or irrigation line in a trench but maybe six, eight, ten inches deep. And then near the pond edge, you would connect that burial line to a remote manifold. And this manifold does a couple things. It splits the air, of course, but it also has valves on each diffuser line. And you want that. You don't want to use a T-fitting or something without controlling the airflow. T-fittings are commonly brought up when people are doing DIY setups. And while I do think they can work if you have diffusers that are very close together, the truth is, I don't know why you'd want to put diffusers that close together. The whole point of having multiple diffusers is to spread the air out in the pond more or spread the release of the air out more. And so we want to spread them out. Problem is that if you start to run into differences in airline distances from the manifold to the diffuser or the depth varies, the air will go mostly to the point or path of least resistance. And so you get most of your airflow out of one diffuser and the other one isn't doing much of anything. That's not a proper setup. What you want to do is use a valve manifold to control airflow precisely between the diffusers any way you want. You can even shut one off like this one is fully to direct airflow into one diffuser. And there's certain times and cases when you may want to do that. And so a remote manifold is the answer to that. And we work with these from two ports up to four ports. And here is a a three-port manifold as an example too and so they're very handy and this is the way you'd want to set them up again this one has a 5 8 inch line coming in and two 3 8 inch weighted lines going out into the pond to each diffuser cool thing about this particular manifold though it will work with virtually any system or any brand because the threads on this particular coupling is a half inch thread and what's nice is knowing that you can literally go to your local hardware store, look in the irrigation fitting section for something with a half inch thread. And typically you'll see three eighths, half inch or five eighths inch ID weighted airline used in these setups. And you can find all of those typically at most hardware stores. I went to my local Menards, which is in the upper Midwest, and it's a uh, a pretty full-featured hardware store, went into their irrigation fittings, and in looking, I found everything I would ever need to set up with virtually any aeration system the way we typically do it. That might involve using things like um, three-quarter inch PVC, which is typically how Casco likes to go. They use a three-quarter inch ID PVC, and here we're basically connecting to the PVC, stepping down to a 3 8 inch weighted line goes out into the pond. We also have 5 8 inch to 3 8 inch converters to step down from burial tubing to weighted tubing if you just have a single line. We also sometimes will use a 1 inch for very long runs over land. We might use 1 inch and it could be poly, which this fitting would work for that. And we might use PVC and that will work with that. And so basically for the burial side of things, I can change this out to anything I need to fit my burial component. And I can change this out to fit anything from three eighths, half inch, five eighths, which is the typical weighted airlines you'll see used in the industry. And it's a very, very modifiable, adjustable system for whatever you may need. Now that's 
Oh, and I also want to mention too, here is some brass fittings. You can also get brass couplings if you want something a little more durable, and they're still not that expensive for what you're getting. Again, this is a great setup for DIYers because it's so versatile, but I also want to mention why we're starting to use this with some of our commercial systems too. Here's two good examples. Airmax is an excellent brand. I love their systems. They're quiet, efficient. They do a really good job. But when you get into multiple diffusers, two and three diffuser packages, the problem is they don't offer a remote manifold for those sizes. You have to use a larger four port manifold, remote manifold for their systems. It's also priced at $499 for the manifold alone. And it's only set up to take one inch incoming burial line. So I guess the problem with that is it's expensive for what you're getting. And the truth is you don't need to go that far if you only have two or three diffusers. And so what we do with that particular brand is we use typically 5 8 inch polyline coming in. We may use one inch if you want to, but we typically use 5 8 inch polyline coming in and then we can set it up with 3 8 or 5 8 going out. And Airmax typically likes to use 5 8 inch weighted larger line on any runs, tubing runs over two to 300 feet from the manifold to the diffuser, or if you're dealing with very deep ponds, you might want to step up to the 5 8 inch line. But this particular manifold and the three port manifold would be much, much less expensive than the Airmax option that they give you. This one, along with the valve box, is priced right around $120. So you're saving well over $350 just through this fitting option alone from what they offer. So I think that's significant enough to consider it. And this manifold is a quality manifold. The other place where I think we see some potential use here is with the Casco brand. Casco has a very nice remote manifold package. They're not as costly as Air Max. And so for many people, you might still want to go with their remote manifold kits. I think they're, they're well made and they're good value. However, for their single diffuser packages, one of the things that you'll see is there is no manifold involved with that particular kit. It's just fittings that run from a 3 8 inch, 3 8 inch lead hose coming out of the pump in the cabinet, and that's heat resistant. And that would typically have a fitting that would attach to the 3 quarter inch PVC that we mentioned before. PVC would run in ground and at the pond edge, you would transition the three quarter PVC to three eighths inch or five eighths inch weighted line. It's only two fittings that are in this package, yet the cost of that package is $120. I can do the same thing by going to my local hardware store and, or we can provide the fittings to you, uh, three eighths to five eighths or three eighths to uh, three quarter inch uh, PVC and you can do it probably for less than $10. And so I think this is a place where people can save money and not compromise the system in any way, shape, or form. Where you want to make sure you do this right is getting a good pump, a good quality diffuser, because those are the guts of the system and they represent where the quality needs to be for perform performance, longevity, all that stuff that we're looking for. These other components, as long as they're well made, as long as they're quality components you're replacing the factory stuff with, you really can't go wrong and you can definitely save a fair amount of money. So I hope that information helps. As always, you can reach out to me at AmericanAeration.com if you have questions on any setup with this remote type of a manifold. If you're wondering if you can re use remote power instead of alternative energy sources like wind or solar, or what will work best for you, feel free to reach out. I'm happy to help, and I appreciate you watching. I hope you have a great day wherever you are.